Today I bring to you the best palava sauce recipe popularly known by all Ghanaians as in Kontumri. Welcome to my very first cooking video. I am Chef Bonch and I bring to you the best continental food recipe every single week. So consider subscribing and turn on your post notifications so you don't miss out on any video. For this dish, you will need the following ingredients taro leaves or in contumbri. I got mine from my backyard but it's available in any local market or any African store. I washed it, peeled off the stems and cut them into small sizes as you can see. Four cloves of garlic sliced into pieces, sliced ginger, habanero pepper, sliced onions, and I also have some sliced tomatoes. For the purposes of seasoning, we are going to blend our sliced garlic, ginger, onions. Now we are going to boil our taro leaves and I have the greatest techniques to reveal to you guys. Pour your taro leaves in the pot, add 100 ml water. So you boil your taro leaves for 5 minutes under medium heat. We boiled it for 5 minutes because we do not want to lose the special taste of these taro leaves due to overcooking. The little water together with the steam enables it to soften, preserving its great taste. I left a few or a little of the onions that I'm going to use later. We also have here our blended tomato paste for our main meal. I'll also be adding willy or cow skin and salmon. Let's begin the process. Put your pan on the fire you then pour your red oil or zumi into it make sure you cook at medium heat what i normally do is to test my oil so i put a single slice of onion into the oil now the oil is ready let's add our onions stir gently leave it for two minutes remember to cook at medium heat so it doesn't get burnt you can now add your sliced tomatoes and stir fry with the sliced onions. After 3 to 4 minutes, you add your blended tomatoes. Stir gently. Leave it to simmer for 5 minutes. I blended agushi or melon seeds. Then I added a little bit of water to make it moist. After 5 minutes, we are now going to add our natural seasoning that is blended garlic, ginger, together with the habanero pepper and onions. Mmm, I can smell the aroma all over. This is a good sign. We now add our white melon seeds. Stir gently and leave it to simmer for another 5 minutes. I boiled the willy or cow skin to make it a little bit softer and to bring out the taste. We are going to add it to the stew. At this moment, we add a little salt to taste, then you leave it to simmer for another two minutes. And now to my favorite part, you add your boiled taro leaves and stir gently and leave to simmer for five minutes. Make sure you cover your saucepan. Our palava sauce is almost ready and it looks very palatable. Wow, I can't wait to have a taste of it. Promise me you are going to try this at home. Chef Bonch's Kitchen. Nududu song. Yo, 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 guys. So this is Chef Bunch. Get ready for exciting videos. 